Hello and welcome back. This is Lex Morgan and you are all set to take your MyScore survey. Now, you are on your home screen and from your home screen, we're gonna access the survey. So at the bottom of your screen, you're gonna see a gray area. And in that gray area, you see the option for survey. You're gonna select survey. Now, just above that option, you're gonna see an option for take survey, but you don't wanna select that one. You're gonna select survey in the gray area. Once you've done that, you're gonna to come to the survey screen. It should be yellow, and it's gonna have each of the five questions listed in order for you to answer. Now, I wanna remind you that there's no wrong way to do this, and no matter what you choose, it'll be the perfect answer because this is you evaluating you. Now, the instructions say, rate, now, rate yourself now on a scale of one to five for each question. But before we start answering any questions, I wanna invite you to just use your finger. There's a little ball there for each question and just slide it back and forth. And you'll notice that the number on the far right of your screen, it goes up and down based on the option that you choose, what number you choose. So we're going to begin with confidence, meaning how much do you believe in yourself? And this might look like, you might feel like this, or you might feel like this. And the other thing is, it could be somewhere in between. And remember, there's no wrong way and it is okay if you're somewhere in the middle today. That can always change. So I wanna give you a few minutes to answer the question. And I also wanna point your attention to the clues that you have just under each question. So if you're not quite sure which way to answer, you have three options just under the question. So for confidence, as an example, you have unsure of myself, very confident, or crazy self-assured. So you may be here, or you may be there, somewhere in the middle, and it's all okay. So take a moment to answer that question, and then we'll move to question two. Now that you've completed question one, we're gonna move on to how excited are you about learning? Meaning, how curious are you? Do you see learning as an adventure? Do you feel like, yes, I'm really excited like this? Or do you feel like, eh, not so much, and like this? And again, it could be somewhere in the middle, and that's okay. Be gentle with yourself. Be honest about how you feel because you're the expert here. Now take a moment, and then we're gonna move to question three. How well do you get along with others? Meaning, do you think of learning as a team sport? You do better when you're in a team, or you feel like, no, nah, I'd rather be by myself. So are you feeling like, here? Or, no, I really need to fly solo, like, I need to do this by myself. Somewhere in the middle, give yourself a moment to think about it and evaluate yourself there. And we're almost done. Question four, what do you do when things get hard? How courageous are you? Are you more likely to try harder like this? Or are you more, to say, more likely to say, you know what, that's not really working for me? And it's more like this. And again, it's okay that it's not either or. You might be somewhere in the middle. That's all right. And last, but certainly not least, how career and future focused are you? What do you wanna become? What do you wanna create? What do you see your future like? What do you dream about? Is it like this over here? Like, yes, I got this. Or you know what? I really don't know what I'm gonna do. And you might not be sure, and that's okay. So before you hit submit, I want you to go back and just look at each of your answers and make sure that they fit you, that they feel like this is how you truly, truly are feeling today. And once you know, you're gonna scroll to the bottom of the survey and you're gonna select submit. And the very next screen you're gonna see is gonna thank you for taking the time to complete the MyScore survey. And because your voice and feedback is so valuable, someone from your support team, either your teacher or your AmeriCorps member will be in touch with you soon.